Hello everyone, welcome to Home Cooking with me Hema Subramanian. Daba food is something that we all enjoy and uh, being at home, I think sometimes we like to explore the Daba food. So today I'm going to share this wonderful Kadai chicken recipe, Daba style. So let's get started and check out the recipe. So for the Kadai chicken, first I'm going to dry roast a few ingredients for the masala. For this, we're going to start off with one and a half tablespoons of coriander seeds, one teaspoon cumin seeds, 1 teaspoon fennel seeds, 1 teaspoon whole peppercorns, a small piece of cinnamon and 3 cloves. So after about a minute add 6 red chilies. Roast the ingredients on medium flame so you don't want to keep it on high because they can easily get burnt. So after about 4 minutes turn off the stove. Transfer the ingredients to another plate and cool it completely. So the ingredients for the masala is cooled down completely, transfer to a mixer jar and grind it to a nice fine powder. So you can see the masala powder is ground beautifully. The aromas are fresh and fragrant. Take a nice white kadai. To this I'm adding about one and a half tablespoons of ghee and add about one tablespoon of oil. Once the kadai is heated up, just add one teaspoon of cumin seeds. Next add three large onions, finely chopped. Saute the onions till they are a nice golden brown colour. So you can see the onions have come to a nice golden brown colour. To this add two teaspoons of ginger garlic paste. To this, I'm going to add two tomatoes chopped and two green chilies slit. To this, add quarter teaspoon turmeric powder, one teaspoon salt, two teaspoons Kashmiri red chilli powder. Add the puree of three tomatoes and cook for about five minutes. After 5 minutes, add the chicken pieces. For this recipe, I've taken about 1 kilo of chicken with bone. Add the chicken pieces and mix everything together. Cook for 5 minutes. So after about 5 minutes, I'm going to add the freshly ground masala powder. Now I'm not adding all of it. I'm just going to add about 3 teaspoons initially. After 5 minutes, add about 1 cup of water. At this point, you can check for seasoning and add salt. So I'm adding about 1 teaspoon of salt. Close and cook for about 20 minutes. So after 5 minutes, I'm going to add 1 capsicum that's been cut into wedges and 1 small onion that's been cut into wedges. Close and cook for another 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, add the remaining ground masala powder. So mix everything nicely, you can see the kadai chicken is coming together beautifully. The aromas are absolutely fantastic. So finally add some crushed kasuri methi. Add a few ginger julienes. 
and finish off this incredibly delicious daba style kadai chicken. So there you go, here is this absolutely delicious Daba style kadai chicken that you can enjoy with some nice roti, naan, fulkas by the side. So do try the recipe, enjoy and share it with your family and friends.